I was free from cancer for five years and five days. And then on that fifth day, I happened to go in for my six month checkup and the routine test found two swollen lymph nodes in, in my chest, just below my heart. They did a biopsy of the uh, lymph nodes and discovered that the bladder cancer was back and they recommended chemotherapy followed by immunotherapy. So when we think about the role of, um, of maintenance immunotherapy, the definition of that is patients getting um, immunotherapy following chemotherapy where their physician feels that the chemotherapy was helpful, that the chemotherapy led to a um, disease stability or some degree of response or even a remission where the, where the uh, cancer really shrinks down on the scan. So the idea of maintenance is instead of waiting for the cancer to grow, instead of responding to the cancer, we are now able to use immunotherapy to try and maintain that response by giving it sooner rather than waiting for the cancer to progress. With chemotherapy, although I expected much worse, uh, the, the side effects are relatively mild, a bit of queasiness for 10 weeks, which could be annoying. Um, and a little bit of the chemo brain and just feeling quite tired all the time. Once my uh, chemotherapy was done and deemed successful, the doctor uh, encouraged me to do immunotherapy because there was more, more than likely uh, cancer cells in the body indefinitely with bladder cancer. And so uh, he encouraged me to do immunotherapy as a form of maintenance. It will continue to push back, push back, push back anything, if it works, and it has been, any, any cancer that might be growing. And now that I'm on immunotherapy, I will be on it indefinitely, uh, but I'm finding that the uh, it's largely painless. I go in every two weeks for about a four-hour infusion, and aside from the scheduling, my life goes on the way it was before. I'm back doing workouts at the local community center. I walk every day. I can travel, as I said, I can be with friends and uh, visiting friends coming in and family. And my attitude is you play the hand you're dealt. And uh, I have managed to do that without regret and to keep a bright attitude.